T minus 15 seconds. Guidance is internal. 12, 11, 10, 9. Ignition sequence start. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. All engine running. Liftoff. We have a liftoff. 32 minutes past the hour. Liftoff on Apollo 11. Tower cleared. We've got a roll program. Neil Armstrong reporting the roll and pitch program, which puts Apollo 11 on a proper heading. Downrange 35 miles, 30 miles high. Standing by for the outboard engine cut down now. Station. And ignition. 11 Houston, thrust is go. All engines, you're looking good. Tower's gone. Roger, tower. Neil Armstrong confirming both the engine skirt separation and the launch escape tower separation. 11, this is Houston. You are go for staging. Over. Understand. Go for staging. And Stand by for mode 4 capability. To mode 4. Mark, mode 4 capability. Mode 4 and Apollo 11 could get into orbit using the service propulsion system now. Altitude is 100 miles, downrange 883 miles. Outboard engine cutoff. And ignition. Ignition confirmed, thrust is go, 11. And we have a good third stage now. Velocity 23,128 feet per second. Downrange 1,000 miles, altitude 101 miles. Apollo 11, this is Houston. Predicted cutoff at 11 plus 42. Over. 1142, Grinch. We're predicting third stage shutdown at 11 minutes 42 seconds. Shutdown. Shutdown right on time. Apollo 11, this is Houston. The booster has been configured for orbital coast. Both spacecraft are looking good. Over. Apollo 11, this is Houston. Uh, we just got telemetry back on your booster, and it's looking good. This is Apollo Control. We're 10 minutes away from ignition and translunar injection. We want to add uh, 10,435 feet per second to the spacecraft's velocity. Looking for a total velocity at the end of this burn about 35,575 feet per second. Apollo 11, this is Houston. Uh, slightly less than one minute to ignition, and everything is go. Right here. Ignition. We confirm ignition, and the thrust is go. Guidance looking good. Velocity 26,000 feet per second. Apollo 11, this is Houston. Around three and a half minutes. You're still looking good. Your predicted cutoff is right on the nominal. Factor Apollo 11, go. 35,000 feet per second. Cut off. We're showing velocity 35,570 feet per second, altitude 177 nautical miles. Apollo 11, this is Houston. We show, show cutoff and uh, we copy the numbers and now in 62. Yeah, Houston, uh, Apollo 11, that Saturn gave us a magnificent ride. All right, your 11, we'll pass that on and it certainly looks like you're well on your way now. That was Neil Armstrong praising the launch vehicle. Apollo 11, uh, this is Houston. For your information, we expect the maneuver to separation attitude to begin at uh, 3 plus 0, 05 plus 0, 03 and to be completed at uh, plus 0, 09 plus 20. Uh, separation at 3 plus 1, 5 plus 0, 0. Roger. 
This is Apollo Control at three hours into the mission. Velocity now 31,214 feet per second. Apollo 11's distance from Earth, 1,245 nautical miles. The S-4B is reported in a stable attitude for this separation. One minute to separation. Apollo 11, this is Houston. Uh, your go for separation. We're awaiting confirmation of separation. We confirm the separation here on the ground. Secondary propellant on uh, Quad Bravo. Roger, we copy. All uh, right, he's stand by. The Goldstone Station reports a very weak signal. Uh, we believe that uh, Mike Collins is now maneuvering the spacecraft uh, in the transposition and docking maneuver and uh, the antenna patterns aren't too good at the moment. So we have a weak signal strength. Houston Broadcasting in the Blind, request Omni Bravo, if you read us, request Omni Bravo, out. Apollo 11, this is Houston, how do you read? Mike, and we understand that you are, Doc. That's fine. This is Apollo Control. We're 34 minutes away from ejection of the lunar module and about 35 minutes away from this evasive maneuver. The ignition time on the evasive maneuver, uh, an elapsed time of 4 hours, 40 minutes, 1 second. It will be a uh, service propulsion system burn of three seconds duration, delta V uh, 19.7 feet per second. Houston, we're ready for LAM ejection. Uh, Roger, you go for LAM ejection. Thank you. Houston, we are set. We have a cryo press light. Roger, copy, cryo, press line. Apollo 11, this is Houston. In reference to your question on RCS usage, uh, it looks like you're about uh, 18, maybe 20 pounds uh, below nominal at the present time. No problem at all, over. Right. Why to be 18, 20 pounds above nominal, babe? Sorry about that. This is Apollo Control at 4 hours 34 minutes. We're about 5 minutes away from the evasive maneuver. That will ensure uh, there will be no problems of recontact between the spacecraft and the S-4B stage of the launch vehicle. Eleven uh, Houston, your systems are looking good. We're standing by for the burn. The duration of this burn will be three seconds. Delta V 19.7 feet per second. Ignition. Shut down. 
and 11 for your information. The uh, magnitude of mid-course correction number one, uh, if we burned it, looks like about uh, one seven feet per second. Uh, we're presently considering not burning it. Uh, this would make uh, mid-course correction two tomorrow about uh, 21.3 over. That sounds good to us. Roger, you're looking good down here. Uh, we've advised the crew that uh, we do not believe that we'll do the uh, first mid-course correction, that we'll wait for uh, mid-course correction two tomorrow and expect a, uh, a delta V to be performed in that maneuver of about 21.3 feet per second.